All right, guys, and welcome back to Ghost of Tsushima. We are here. I've just been standing here for ages, just watching the waves lap against these wooden, broken frames of old, what I don't know, an old dock, an old shipping dock or something. But it's it's so peaceful and so calming. Honestly, I can't tell you. You could just stand here for hours. If you ever feel like just having a little relax inside a game, there's very few that do it as well as this. Well. Thank you for joining me. Thanks a lot. And uh, please go leave a like if you can. I'm just still admiring all the textures in this game. I do love the way they put it together. It's, it's simply gorgeous. But we're here to try the next, possibly last, mythic tale on the island. We have to go and listen to this chap over here. I should just show you on the map what it is, if I can find it. Yeah, this, this mythic tale right here. I can't highlight it. There it is. The Legacy of Kazuma Sasaki. Sakai, even. <laughs> Survivors are sheltering in the wreckage of a ship near Zasho Bay. I wonder if they will welcome my company. Okay, so these are survivors of a shipwreck. Let's see what tales they have to tell. Who are you? Thought I knew every face on Iki. Just a traveler. Stranded here by the Eagle tribe. You're welcome to join us. If you want to hear an old man complain about the past. We survived one invasion. And we can do it again. Or have you all forgotten how much we suffered at the hands of the samurai? That was nothing compared to the danger we face now. Nonsense. You are too young to know anyway. It's past time I remind you all about the dark days of the samurai invasion. About the brutality of Kazumasa Sakai. Yeah, I'm beginning to feel guilty already. Fifteen years ago, our home was invaded by an army of ruthless samurai. Their leader was Kazumasa Sakai, the Butcher of Iki. Dear old dad. He rode to battle atop his demonic beast, shielded with armor as black as his master's heart. Luckily, the Butcher made a grave mistake when he came to Iki. He brought his whelp of a son. Our bravest warriors hunted the boy. <laughs> Not to kill, but to tempt his bloodthirsty father. Kazumasa gave chase and rode into a trap. His armored horse met a grisly end, but the butcher and his runt son survived, then fled like cowards. Enough of these lies. That is not what happened. I lived near Senjo Gorge. I saw it with my own eyes. So did I. Who are you? My name is Jin Sakai. Kazumasa Sakai was my father. He gave his life trying to help this island. Help! He murdered us! Your people repaid his help by murdering him. Is that why you're here? To avenge your father and take my head? Uh, I'm not my father, but maybe. <laughs> you may be a liar, but you are not my enemy. Not yet. Stop this! You're acting like wild dogs! I came here to help, not for revenge. You mentioned my father's horse armor. After he died, we never recovered it. We know. Tell me where it is, and I can use it to ride against the Eagle tribe. I would die before I help a samurai. It's time you leave. Well, okay, what a threat. So it's, I would die before I help a samurai. We can easily arrange this, but the legacy of Kazumasa Sakai begins. So he mentioned horse armor. That's going to look great on Sora. Stay out. He knows something about my father's horse armor, but he'll never tell me unless I listen in on him without being seen. You're not welcome here. Right. So we've got to sneak into the camp to hear the rest of the story. Okay. There's gonna be another way. Let's try up this side. Uh, they obviously don't know I'm <laughs> I'm doing this. They've got no idea. Uh, is this where we go? It must be. Ooh, I like it. Now, surely I don't kill anybody here. I've just got to be stealthy. Watch out which way these guards are facing. 
That guy by the doorway is stopping me from moving downwards, but I can see that's where the game is telling me to go. Is it too direct though? I wonder what all these walkways are for otherwise. Oh god. Need to catch up. Don't let him get away. Oh god. No no. Don't do it. One more word about noble samurai, and I would have What's this? Jiro. Why is there a I lost six family members to the samurai invasion. My sister was still a child. The way they were butchered. Bastard! We couldn't Oh damn it, okay. I uh I didn't realise it was gonna be that tough. Okay. I understand now, so we really got to keep out the eye. I was he, the when he when he cowered like that. I thought I was all right. <laughs> Clearly not. Let me drop down here. One more word about noble samurai, and I would have. Jiro. I lost six family members to the samurai invasion. My sister was still a child. Oh. The way they were butchered. I'm in the shadows. He, he can't see me. Everything to give them a proper burial. He ran away, but he did that see me. Never should have happened. What's going on? What have I got to do? This is so weird. Hi. That guy doesn't seem to mind too much, so that's a little bit weird. I can be seen by some, but not by s certain others. Do I go down? I guess so. What about the rest of your story? Ah, yes. I was just getting to the good part. Kazumasa fell for our traps and lost his armored horse. As our warriors closed in, the butcher and his boy fled into Senjo Gorge. There we go, Senjo the Gorge. limped through the canyon and ran headfirst into an ambush. There was no grand battle, only a few raiders with dull blades. But that was all it took. One swing to end the life of Kazumasa Sakai. While the samurai slunk home, we recovered the armor from Kazumasa's mount. Over the years, our finest horses wore that armor. Every one of them killed its rider. As if possessed by the butcher's vengeful spirit. Oh, come on. So we sold his horse's armor to the Ida merchant family. The cursed armor left our shores aboard the merchant fleet as a storm descended on our island. The sky roared with the thunder of a thousand charging samurai, and the raging tempest shattered the Ida ships against our rocky coastline. The ruins of that doomed fleet still choke Zasho Bay. And somewhere in that watery graveyard lies the cursed armor once worn by the horse of Kazumasa Sakai. Well, now we know where to go. <clears throat> is that right? Is that it? Are we done? Can I... Yes, My we... father's horse armor is still lost in Zashou Bay. Armor should be on the merchant's lead ship, marked by the Ida family banner. Was it gold or red? Okay, gold or red? I'm, I can't remember. <laughs> we will try them both if we get the chance. Well, there's some... Uh, I was going to say, I actually was going to use the phrase dead survivors. <laughs> <laughs> there are some dead survivors on the beach. Uh, yeah, yeah, there are just dead people here on the beach. So, I have to swim over there? Or swim out around here? Let's try this. It's 
gonna be rough, and nobody else has dared to try to find this armor. But the brave Jin Sakai can take on any challenge, even violent waves. <laughs> oh God, come on, Jin, let's do this. Now that's a, there's a boat on top of the. Oh, look at this. We've got we've got places to walk and run. Start with this rock face here. Okay, this looks right. This looks good. There are two ships. Well, actually, there's a hell of a lot more. I say two ships, but there are heaps of them. Oh, I did not like that sound. Whoa! You ass! I think we can rule out that location as being useful. What are we supposed to do? Ah, this might help. Might not be a good idea to stand right here though, Jin. Progress at last. Uh, what now? Ah, I see. Okay, can we jump and hit the other one? Ah, that works. Should be able to. Should be able to cling on to that. Hmm. I think I might have to swim all the way around. I have to swim around and do that again. Yes, we do. All right. At least we've l unlocked the path ahead. Oh, that's it. Nice. Uh oh. Here she comes again. The curse of Kazumasa Sakai is real. Once your horse wears this armor, he will feel your father's terrible bloodlust, and he will kill you. I can't believe my horse would kill me. Still, I'm willing to find out. Sora and I are like brothers. It cannot be true. Banners of the Eda family. I guess he's talking about that ship up there. Uh, why is that got... I had an... Hmm. Oh, God. Can I land on that rock? Just. Okay. Maybe this is all about timing. Not getting hit by the waves. Oh, God, as predicted. Now we know. Ooh. Quick, quick, quick. Okay, so you can grapple onto the ropes. That worked nicely. Right, let's wait for a wave to come in. Go for it. Um, I think I have to go into the water then, over to this rock. Let's go off. Oh, you 
you absolute <sighs> it's gonna be fine now there's a way back there that can't be right though this is this is where does this lead me then more rocks with water aha don't collapse don't collapse we're in. <gasps> there she is. My father's horse armor. We'll see if it fits Soda. Awesome, we did it. Sako horse armor forged to protect the fearless war horse of Kasumasa Sakai. Okay. Sora's looking a little bit frisky. You well, sort of. Oh my word. Curse or not, you wouldn't throw me, would you, boy? Check that out. Like my father's horse. May this armor protect you in battle. Well, I guess we're about to find out. They found the survivor's camp. Come, Sora. Let's do a little charging, shall we? Ooh, this is where we find out. Oh god. With the horse armor equipped, horse charge inflicts more damage, and incoming attacks attacks are less likely to dismount you. Oh, this is awesome! <laughs> How do you like that? That was beautiful. Let's have another go. There you go. So I've saved you all. Oh, there's more. I don't think so. Not today, Mr. Shaman. Ho, 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 ho. Beautiful. Look at the sword. That sword is going on spinning forever. Oh, stunning. Absolute decimation. Speak with the survivors. I bet they're going to be completely ungrateful. And no doubt throw me a hefty warning Samurai. impossible oh look at Sora covered in blood the blood of the enemy <laughs> your horse is that the horse armor of Kazuma Sasaki restored to his son and cursed no more after everything I said you saved us I'm not your enemy or accept my apology. Yeah, go on then. I'm sorry for everything you lost to the samurai. I can't bring your family back, Jiro. But I will fight for Iki in their memory. You're better with words than your father. I will stand by them. Good. It's the least you can do. I never thought I would say this, but... Thank you, Lord Sakai. Well, I gotta say, Sora is looking mean as hell. What a beautiful set of armor. Oh, we got a we got a trophy, Treasures of the Past. I guess that means we've done all of something. Now, what should we do next? I'm thinking maybe we should finish off that side quest over here um, before doing. The main story. Do you remember in the last episode we, we met someone called Sugi and she revealed that she was once a member of Yamaneko's crew, a band of raiders who have gained Huachas. Those are the uh, the fire catapults from the seas from the Mongols. After I helped her stop the attack on her village, she agreed to help me break up their alliance. So let's go. I should be able to travel very close to it. What is this rumored location? Oh, it is that one. Okay. So we have Sakai banners to do. I'll probably pick up those offline. I'm not sure I'll, I'll, I'll record the collection of absolutely everything. Uh, let's head over to... Oh, let's head over to the Viper location, which was pretty cool. A very cool fight, that is. But it's a nice location as well. And I think now Sora is armed. I want to see a lot more of her in the game. Or him. I don't know. I always thought Sora was a was a girl because Sora means sister well at least in Romanian 
And, uh... Well, here we go. This is the place Sugi mentioned. Where is she? Beautiful. More of Yamaneko's crew. I'll deal with them. Right, let's stand off these fools. I know, I'm, I know I've got the horse and we could do a little charging, but... This is so much more fun. Lower your corpse tonight. Yeah. Not happening, is it? I've actually unlocked... Very cool moves. If I can... Get through them, I mustn't take any damage. Alright, he's done. Did I hear? Oh, I did. The dulcet tones of one of these fools. Right, that's ruined. Right, you ruined everything. Okay. This must be her. No, that's not her. You'll be free soon. Thank you, my lord. So where did she go? That was quite a sight. You're not a samurai ah. or ronin. What exactly are you? I am someone like you. Who knows what it's like to be hunted? I scouted the cove. Yamaneko's crew are trading captives for Mongol watchers. Treasonous slavers. We can't let them have more Mongol weapons. Yes. We'll need to split up. Distract the forces on the beach. I'll take a boat out. I've been slipping aboard ships undetected since I was a child. If Yamaneko is as dangerous as you say... It's my responsibility. Yamaneko is... my brother. Killing your own family... It's harder than you could ever imagine. Yes. All right. I'll head up the coast to where the Mongols and raiders are camped. Find some way to deal with them all. I can take over their watchers, and even the odds for you. Good. If we make it look like the raiders have betrayed the Mongols, they should turn on each other. I'll send you a signal of where to aim. Hmm. A little flower into their campfire will make it flare. Good luck, Sugi. Hmm. You too. Wow, this is cool. Another little side quest to uh, tail off this episode, Bloodletting. There's a lookout post nearby. I can't leave until... I'll take care of them first. Meet me on the northern coast afterward. Right, where do I have to go? Oh, straight over there. Bloodletting. Strange choice of words. Bloodletting used to be a medical technique. If there was something wrong with you, they'd just let out a little blood, basically. Cut you open, let you bleed. But the idea was that the poison was inside your blood, and if you had less of it, Let's check. did he say there's gin? Nothing to find. Yeah, there's nothing to see here. Some kind of noise. Can't see me. It's all over for these two. I, I pressed the wrong button. I was trying to do a chain assassination, but it didn't work. Anyway, we sit and we wait. For what? I don't know. Oh. Once night falls, Sugi can row out to the ship. Wow. Better look around. I see. There are a few more here than there were before. To signal Sugi. Direct her watch attack. This guy's doing a little dance for himself down there. Yamaneko's crew and the Mongols. Working together. This alliance ends here. Time to signal Sugi. Right. So we've got to take out these... Well, at least the one by the fire. One done. 
I will do that signal in a second. I hope, hope, hope the monkey doesn't uh, tell on me. Oh, there's too many. Right, I'll get seen. So I'm going to go for this signaling now. That's done. Oh, here they come. <laughs> that should set the Mongols against Yamanako's crew. Oh, I see. Nice plan. I wasn't quite with it there, but that works beautifully. I think we'll just sit here and let them uh, take each other out. Oh, they're done. So we're left with the double-sworded dude. Let's get the right stance open. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nothing here. Nothing here. <laughs> Loved it. We could have run around there all day. No arrows. I thought that was a pickup point for arrows. Oh, this one right here. Oh, good. So who is next? I love the way this alliance ends exactly there, apparently. Oh, we have more. Let's get a little bit sneaky first, shall we? Is that guy playing the guitar? He is, he's playing the guitar. So how can I... Right, maybe I should... No, sit down. Sit down. Jim. Maybe I should do a little uh, wind chime. Get that guy to look around behind him. I can come up behind the other one. Oh, damn it. Well, that worked really well, didn't it? Easy now, easy now. <laughs> Absolutely battered me. Alright, looking better. Come on in. Oh. We're going to take a little break. Let me take out a smoke bomb. Assassinate your bum. I forgot I had those armed, actually. Far too easy at this range. Five archers on the beach there, and they're all done. Who's who's growling? Oh, there you are. I presume that's an enemy. Just killed them anyway. Here we go. This is great. <laughs> oh, I enjoy this far too much. A little bit of ranged combat. Oh, this is no good. <laughs> That's it. I think they're done. So all we've got to do is get up there now. How do we get up there now? Grab 
whatever's in here. 24 supplies, no less. How do we get up to that spot? Oh, there's another guy up on the... Oh, this is a long shot. I'm going for a range. <laughs> and his buddy's right there below him. I've got no arrows left. Damn it. Surely some of these archers will have dropped some. Huh. Not a sausage. In fact, I could probably fire a sausage with this bow. So damn good. Right, how do I get... Oh. I think we found our answer. A few more arrows. Only six. And some kunai. Dude, and we're gonna be just fine. Oh! Oh, that was right in the back of the head. That should set the Mongols against Yamanaku's crew. Oh, we've done the same trick again. I don't know quite how that works. So, what have I got? Oh, they're fighting, so I've just got to continue. Oh! Oh, I see, they can see me up here. Right, well, let's take out this loser. Oh, guess what? Incoming! I mean, basically, they're fighting each other. They may as well take each other out. I'll just stand here and enjoy the show. Look at him. <laughs> He's gone a little bit too much. I see, I see. He's going crazy, this guy. How many knives can he possibly have in that big pocket of his? Alright, let's do this. Oh, the perfect dodge. Actually blocked one of his red attacks. That's pretty rare. And the wind starts. Come on. Oh, he's still stunned. Oh, no, maybe not. All right, switching up, are we? <sighs> Making it easy for me. Nope. Not happening today, is it? So, I think that's it. I think they're all dead. Yamanaku's dying. crew will be an example to others. Don't sign up with Mongols. Now to meet Sugi up the coast to the north. Right. There's nobody in there anyway. Well, there were. There are. They're dead. Now to meet Sugi up the coast. Um. Oh, what happened? Oh, does she she mean to do that? I bloody hope so. Oh, what a beautiful view. We can get the moon in between. Ah, no, that's not happening. It did look good. Jin's pretty running pretty tired. What's wrong? We're about to encounter the, the eagle again. No sign of Suki's boat. What the hell's going on? Hope Sugi wasn't on board. I'm sure she knew enough to get off there. Don't worry, Jin. All is well. Your new girlfriend's safe. Her red cusser hat. Ah. I think I'm gonna have to take that back. Farewell, Sugi. I wish you better fortune in the afterlife. 
bloodletting is done. Well, um, I don't think she's gone. I, I mean, the, the game wouldn't introduce a character like that immediately to... Oh, maybe they did. Sugi's cat out. Perhaps all that rem... Perhaps, there you go. Perhaps all that remains of Sugi. She's not dead. I should bring this to her husband in the village near the eastern lighthouse. Oh. She was married. Yep, my bad. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. So we've got the hat, but apparently it's left there on the beach. So we have to take it to her husband. Where was that? Near the lighthouse. Oh, is it here? I think so. Let's go back that way. Is that what he said? The dialogue... I've kind of messed up. I wasn't paying attention. I'm guessing it was over here. Is this him? Hello? Any idea where Sugi's fella is? What happened? Clear of that one. A note from Sugi. Oh, oh! So this is this was right. It's safer for everyone if I just disappear. She's alive. I suspect no one understands that more than you. May we both live lives free from being hunted. <laughs> she survived. Good luck, Sugi. To both of us. Oh wow, so we keep the hat because we came back. Sugi's <laughs> Casa hat, worn by the illustrious former raider. Uh, let's check it out. This makes a change from the monkey hat. How awesome does that look? Very nice. It hides Jin's face a little bit too much though. But we'll wear it for a little while. Well guys, so we are, we are just absolutely putting things right all over this island. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm going to go and take down that lighthouse. What a great shot. I'm going to go take down that lighthouse. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode. Where we're going to try and tie up the main story, I think. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like. And I'll see you in the next episode. Love, love, love this game. All the best. Good night.